Hi children, in this video, let us try to understand about this sun. So how the fishermen catch the fish and after drying, they sell it, which is called as dried fish. And when they catch it, what is that fish called as? That is fresh fish. So let us see how the sum goes. When fresh fish is dried, it becomes one third its weight. Whenever we are drying something, what happens? The water in that particular thing gets evaporates and it becomes light weighted. So in the same way, whenever one cage of fresh fish is dried, what happens? It becomes one third of its weight. So now in one month, they plan to dry 6000 kg of fresh fish. They are planning to dry 6000 kg of fresh fish. So in one month, if they are planning to dry 6000 kg of fresh fish, why are they drying? Because fresh fish they take, they dry and they sell dried fish. So how much dried fish will they get in one month? So 6000 kg will become one, thousand, one third. What is one third of 6000? So 6000 is made into three parts and only one part is taken. So 6000 into 1 by 3. So 6000 by 3. What is 6000 by 3? When do we get uh, uh, 6 in 3 table? Like you can do it in this way. 6000 by 3 means you can divide 6000 by 3. 3 twos are 6. And 3 zeros are there. So 3 zeros will come here. So how much is this? 6000 when it is divided by 3, you get 2000. So if you dry 6000 fresh fish, then how much dried fish will you get? You get how much dried fish will they get in one month? So they get a 2000 kg dried fish in one month. 2000 kg dried fish in one month. Now, what is the next question here? Let us calculate for 6 kg of fresh fish. So, what are we trying to calculate? We are trying to calculate for 6 kg fresh fish how much is the money they are going to get. So, for 6 kg fresh fish, how much they are going to get? We buy fresh fish for rupees 15. Fresh fish is buy for rupees 15 and sell it. We sell dry fish for rupees 70 because after drying, the rate of fresh fish is 70 rupees. Now, we dry 6 kg fresh fish to get. Now, 6000 means after drying, each cage becomes how much? One third of it. So, if 6 cage is dried, 6 cage fresh fish is dried, it becomes one third. What is 6 into 1 by 3? 6 into 1 by 3 means 6 ones are 6 by 3. 6 by 3 means 2. So, we dry 6 cage fresh fish to get a 2 cage dried fish. Okay? 6 cage fresh fish is dried to get 2 cage dried fish. Now, for 6 cage fresh fish, we have to pay. What is the cost of fresh fish? Fresh fish is rupees 15 rupees. So 6 kg is what? So 6 into 15 rupees is rupees 90. So you get you are spending rupees 90 in buying fresh fish. It is rupees 90. Now we sell 2 kg dried fish. We got 2 kg. So we are selling 2 kg dried fish to get. What is the cost of dried fish? You are selling it at the rate of 70 rupees. So 2 into 70 rupees. Did you understand? This year here, here it is fresh fish that is given. That's why we took the rate of fresh fish. Fresh fish is 15 rupees. So 6 into 15. But here this is 2 kg dried fish is given. So we are taking the price of dried fish. 2 into 70. 7 twos are 14. So it is 140. Now when you take 6 kg fresh fish, you are spending 90 rupees. And the same 6 kg fresh fish after drying is becoming 2 kg dried fish. And the 2 kg dried fish is becoming 140 rupees if you sell in the market. So what is the difference? Which is more? 90 is more or 140 is more? Obviously 140 is more and when we are drying and when we are selling it, we get more. How much are we getting? So if we dry 6 kg fresh fish, we earn. How much is the money we are going to get? Is total 140 rupees you are getting. But 140 rupees out of 140 rupees you have spent already 90 rupees in buying fresh fish. So you have to subtract that. So 140 minus 90. What is 140 minus 90? It is rupees 50. It is rupees 50. So how much is the profit? Means how much money did you get more 
then how much you have spent you have spent uh, 90 rupees and you have got 140 means 50 rupees more you have got on 6 cage remember on 6 cage we have got 50 rupees more if on 6 cage see on 6 cage you have got rupees 50 more on 6 cage if you have got rupees 50 more you are taking 6000 cage so on 6000 cage how much more will you get means uh, what is the relation what if you do 6 you are getting 6000 you are multiplying 6 by 1000 so in the same way this also should be multiplied by 1000 so for 50 into 1000 so 50 into 1000 is what is 50 into 1000 5 into 1 is 5 here 1 0 here 3 zeros, 4 zeros. 1 2 3 4 so it is 50000 so but if we dry 6000 kg we can earn rupees 50 for 1 1k 1 6 kg here there are 1006 kgs so 6000 kg so 50 into 1000 that is rupees 50000 in one month rupees 50000 in one month did you get it so once again when fresh fish is dried it becomes one third so 6000 becomes a one third one third of 6000 is 2000 now when we are calculating fresh fish is bought for 15, dry fish is bought for rupees 70. We dry 6 kg fresh fish to get 2 kg. 6 kg 1 third is 2 kg. Fresh fish costs 6 into 15 because fresh fish price is 15. So 6 into 15 is 90 and dry fish costs 70. So 2 into 70, 2 kg you get 270 is 140. What is the difference? How much did you get earn? So 140 minus 90 is 50. This 50 is for 6 kg. But if you want to calculate for 6000, you should multiply by 1000 here in the same way 50 also should be multiplied by 1000 so you are earning 50000 in one month per this cage did you understand so once again try to understand it